right. So we'll run through this in a simple manner. We'll start at the beginning. Obviously, this build is going to look a lot better at night than really at any other point. We can fly around a bit here. So we had a dock. Uh, let me turn in game down a bit. We have a dock that we uh, built kind of at the end there. Pretty basic, simple dock. The first thing that we started with, I should start there. The first thing we started with was finding the location. Um, and before I guess we get too far into it, uh, and it only goes along with finding the location, I asked chat in this particular case what they thought as far as the location. I was going to pick somewhere in the plains, or maybe in the meadows, because it's easy to build there. But uh, chat advised me that if you're thinking pumpkin, you're going with the swamp. So we built in the swamp for chat. If you'd like to be a part of that process, I do most of my builds, or generally most of my builds, on stream live uh that's up to you if you want to if you don't you can just watch them after the fact on youtube that's always a good way to do it as well um, but the first thing we had to pick was where we were going to put it we picked this location in the swamp we had another spot we picked over nearby but there are certain things in the swamp you can't destroy uh, uh trees certain trees you can't destroy these blocks these stones I couldn't destroy that was like a oh yeah this is one of the first spots i was going to pick but this stone i couldn't destroy so we went with somewhere where there was a little castle right here we just we demolished the castle and then uh started our build i started the build from the ground up i put these in place on the center and then i built from the center up actually i think i can go into free fly yeah, there you go. You can see the basic floor plan of it all. And on the top, you'll see... Like a perfect little circular... There are the half slabs, and I built a circle around it, and then I went from there and came out to all the edges. I went, uh, what, I, let me see exactly what the angles are. I started with the wood beam one meter and then went to the wood beam 26 degree. And then I went flat where we had flat blocks here or flat wood here, but we took those out. So the smoke would have an outlet. The smoke's outlet looks really awesome. Uh, just cause of that. That was a good add on via the chat. Thanks again, guys. Uh, and then again, 26 degree, and then I think these are they're called 45. Yeah, 45 degree, then three flat, and 45, and 26, and then you're smooth with the ground. What's a little entrance on the back? I knew I was going to have to have an entrance somewhere, just one big circular thing. Wasn't super great. And then from there, we've built out the sides. We put this in there, put the eyes and the nose and the mouth. The mouth, the teeth are just the back of a bone tower shield put up against the wall. The eyes were pretty simple. We just left a half block in there. Look, look great. Uh, we tried glass in the eyes. It doesn't show through as well or glow as much as I, I would like it to have. Um... And then same thing with the nose and the mouth. So we just kind of left it as it is. Pretty simple, pretty basic. Uh, I know I wanted to add as many of the amenities as I could to the build. But we started to feel the crampedness of the build as we went along. We could have probably put the workbench down here uh, and the forge down here. But I think it made more sense to keep all the food related stuff. All the stuff that you would do in home. In home. So the storage is here. Mead. Bread. All that stuff. Uh, and then as well. Um, the storage could be maybe stacked up another level or two if need be. This is one of the more functional fun 
builds that I've made. I know they're all technically functional, but this one I think would stand pretty well. <laughs> shoot things from the nose and so on and so forth or maybe if you don't go with a pumpkin you could still use some of this as like a defense uh warden off the defense oh we left the workbench we had up here in here oh we were going to take this down initially now it just kind of fleshes out the build the build that's cool yeah the issue we have i always have with these chopping block and this uh a daze i think they're outside things so i put them outside but yeah, this is a uh, this is a functional workbench. I think it's missing one part, the leather, but that's fine. Bed, I like a raised bed. I'm always gonna like a raised bed. Somewhere to sit, something to eat, kitchen, fully functional. Probably one of the better ones I've made. This little tiny shelf is clipped off of the hearth right there and it came out real nice and then back over here we got the artisan table some more uh rich storage and outside we have somewhere to take a bath can't knock having somewhere to take a bath I don't know why anyone would want to live in the swamp, but here we are. Got a, like I said, simple dock, kind of a cool angular bridge. And then the full workbench and full forge with stuff around to boot. Made some little cabinets. I wish these opened out this way, but yeah, so there you go. There's our pumpkin base build, or just pumpkin. I picked the pumpkin because uh, Halloween, <laughs> and I wanted to make something Halloween focused and give everybody a cool little pumpkin to look at. Hopefully. The, the goal of all these builds is just to inspire. Uh, they're not always supposed to be practical. If you find stuff that you like uh, and you want to, you know, rip and take, that's cool. I just want to help people uh, work their imaginations through. Like I said before, I do the entire build generally on, on stream, uh, live with chat. So if you guys have suggestions, or you guys prefer something to go a specific way or not you can always throw that in and we can try it out i definitely change the build as i'm going based on feedback that i'm getting so is that for what you will thank you all for hanging out and thanks for watching the this part of the thing that i'm making okay <laughs>